when to use quantitative research. This video lecture discusses the main reasons why quantitative research is preferable over qualitative research. For more video lectures on quantitative research, such as what is quantitative research and kinds of quantitative research, please go to the description box below. We have provided there a list of topics in quantitative research and their YouTube links. Now, regardless of the subject of study, there are always two types of research to choose from, namely, qualitative and quantitative. Please note that how much the researcher knows about the area of research and her respondents will determine exactly which kind of research is right for her. In some cases, researchers will need a combination of the two to get the most accurate data. But when is the best time to use quantitative research? First, we must remember that quantitative research is used to quantify behaviors, opinions, attitudes, and other variables and make generalizations from a larger population. Hence, quantitative research uses quantifiable data to articulate facts and reveal patterns in research. For this reason, quantitative research involves the use of statistical, mathematical tools to derive results. Now, quantitative research is preferable if First, the researcher gathers a large amount of data and analyze them statistically. For instance, the researcher wants to know the opinion of the Filipino people on the implementation of the national ID system. Here, the researcher will conduct opinion research from a huge number of population. As we can see, the results of this opinion research are based on larger sample sizes that are representative of the population. Second, the researcher wants to be more scientific in her approach. For example, if the researcher wants to know the opinion of the Filipino people on the implementation of the national ID system, then a quantitative research method is the most appropriate method here. Third, the researcher wants to be as objective as possible in analyzing the data. This because quantitative research almost erases bias, and if more researchers ran the analysis on the data, they would always end up with the same numbers at the end of it. Fourth, the researcher wants to be more focused in her study. This is because in quantitative research, the design of the study is clearly determined before the research begins. Fifth, the researcher wants to replicate her study. As is well known, quantitative research can usually be replicated or repeated, given of course its high reliability. In fact, quantitative research is usually recommended in later stages of research because it produces more reliable results. Sixth, the researcher wants a more structured tools, such as questionnaires or surveys to collect numerical data. Seventh, the researcher wants to gather a more precise, reliable, and consistent data. Of course, these data can hardly be obtained using qualitative research. Eighth, the researcher wants to gather data fast. This is because data collection using quantitative methods is relatively quick. Also, data analysis is relatively less time-consuming, especially with the use of statistical software. These are just some of the reasons why quantitative research is more preferable over qualitative research. If you have ideas to share in relation to this topic, please feel free to comment below. Many research students will really benefit from it. Thank you and I wish you all the best.